Hey guys, it's Jeff from Pressure Luck, and boy do I have a surprise for you today. Literally. In fact, this recipe is called Instant Pot Magical Surprise. Now, it's always been a goal of mine to expand everyone's horizons, and so I took some inspiration from my new favorite cookbook, Entertaining with Insects. And this book has some amazing recipes in there that all deal with cooking, you guessed it, insects. Now I know what you're thinking. Ew, bugs. But on the contrary, insects are actually very good for you. They're full of protein and all sorts of wonderful things that I can't even get into right now. So I've taken inspiration from such a wonderful cookbook and I'm going to adapt one for the Instant Pot. And it's gonna be called Instant Pot Magical Surprise. And the best part is, you can get all of these ingredients practically right in your own backyard or shoddy pipes. And this dish isn't called Magical Surprise for nothing. Oh no, wait until you see the end result and what happens. All right, but enough of this prefacing. Let's go right to our prep table because we have a few mealworms to grind. Now the very first ingredient to our surprise pie is going to be some freshly dried mealworms. Now these worms are really perfect because they were nice and toasted and a lot of the crunch to them is gonna be added because of this. And it's gonna be great when we blend them up right in our food processor here, which we're about to do. Now you can find these at pretty much any pet store or local worm market or even your own backyard. So just add them to a little food processor, secure the lid, and then blend them up. Ah, look at that. Perfect. Now we can remove our lid from the food processor, and there we have it. We've just created a beautiful mealworm flour. Now let's just set that aside. Now let's go to our Instant Pot and add our ingredients. I'm going to start by adding my delicious mealworm flour, which I've recently pulverized. Some wonderfully fresh and delicious soil or dirt from our garden. Mmm, and it's organic too. About six worms from our garden. Oh, stop jiggling, you're making my hands tickle. One egg that's about this color of brown, about a duty shade. And you can typically get these from rabbits that lay these, okay? So let's just cut this egg in half. Mmm, and look at that delicious, thick, creamy yolk we have inside of our duty egg. Put that inside of the pot. Looking good. Now it's time to add in a few pink candied bunnies. These guys are perfect, and you can usually find them growing on trees in your yard. Oh, they look like they're having such fun. And last but not least, of course our pot won't come to pressure unless we have some liquid in it, so we're going to add some muddy water to it. Mmm, look at how everything looks so happy once that's added. Doesn't that look good? Okay, now we're gonna stir everything around in the pot. Make sure we get everything nice and mixed together. And don't worry, they don't call this magical surprise for nothing, because guys, this thing forms on its own. We don't need a pot within a pot here. You're gonna see the amazing results we're gonna get. That sure looks great. Now that we have everything nice and mixed together, we're gonna pop our lid on and we're gonna cook. So now let's secure our lid and make sure we're in sealing position. So now let's come down to our pot and hit the manual or the pressure cook button depending on your model. And we're simply gonna go guys on this for zero minutes because that's how magical this is, just zero minutes. And now that we're done, let's quick release. And now that our pin is dropped, let's take the lid off. And there we have it, our beautiful Instant Pot Magic Surprise. It looks like a beautiful pie. And the way it forms so perfectly inside the pot without putting it inside of a pan must be those magical mealworms and organic dirt. And I'm sure the muddy water helped too. But wait, it's changing. Now it's a bunch of chocolate chip cookies. Look at that. This really is a magic surprise. <gasps> An ice cream cake? No way. Who knew that a few wriggly worms and a really dark brown egg can make such amazing results? <gasps> Again? Chicken livers? Oh. Wow, look at that. Mmm, who's ready to have some more? I can't even believe how amazing this Instant Pot Magic Surprise is. You just never know what goodies you're gonna get. But beware, when the one that you touch is the one that you eat. Oh, mm -hmm. oh okay. And since this is the one that I touched, I guess I have to have the chicken livers. Oh boy, here we go. I don't know if they're cooked or not, but... Uh, April Fools! Oh, come on now. Did you really think I'd do it? Listen, I respect anybody who wants to eat bugs. This is actually a legit cookbook, and that's wonderful. I give everybody props to it, but I'm not going to be cooking bugs in the Instant Pot. And it's all about having a sense of humor, right? You need to be able to laugh at things. This is not to be taken seriously, so please, people who are, like, angry about this, don't come after me. Just laugh. It was a joke. No animals or bugs were harmed in this making. In fact, the mealworms were Rice Krispies, in case you couldn't tell. And the worms, they were gummy worms. Also, in case you couldn't tell. I don't think a lot of you believe this is a real recipe anyway. And if you did, well, 
I'll have what you're having because I would love to be that detached from reality. Thank you guys so much again. Have a great day and laugh. It's all about laughing. All right, uh, and I'm gonna make shop liver with this. Make that recipe, that's delicious.